The Red Hawks played their final game of the season, hosting the Skyhawks of UT Martin. Daniel Simmons got off to a good start in his final game as a Red Hawk, scoring eight first half points. All eight of those points came less than four minutes into the game. Simmons went two for two from three point range as a part of the Red Hawks seven threes. The top shooter from the outside was Ray Kowalski, who hit three three pointers. It was the third time in the past five games in which he hit at least three threes. While some of the Red Hawks started well, their top two season long scorers struggled early on. Denzel Mahoney and Ladarius Brewer combined to shoot just one of eight from the field in the first half for only five points between the two of them. Brewer turned things around in the second half, shooting 50% from the field for 13 points in the second half to finish with 16. It was his 25th game this season with double digit scoring. And he had at least 10 points in all but one conference game this season. Mahoney's inability to make shots continued in the second half, shooting just two of eight from the field. He finished the game with 11 points and ended the season averaging 19.3 points per game. The most of any Red Hawk since Tyler Stone scored 19.3 back in the 2013-2014 season. Mahoney was also the second leading scorer in the OVC this season behind only Jonathan Stark of Murray State. Southeast lost to UT Martin 72-66 and ended the season 14-17, 8-10 in OVC play, 7th place in their OVC regular season standing.